did a show in Detroit and we did a place called Buddies. Met the whole family, played bocce ball with them. They were Italian, a guy worked in a factory and his wife would cook and she says, get something so I can make pizza. And he brought these pans that they used to keep nuts and bolts. Wound up making a delicious pizza. It was just very robust. That's what I remember about it the most. When I bit it, it bit me back. Here we are, round two. I'm Sal. I'm Fran. We're at Lions and Tigers and Squares in New York City, corner of 23rd and 8th Avenue, selling Detroit pizza in New York City. You know what's really cool about Detroit-style pizzas? We never thought to put cheddar cheese on a pizza. Usually pizza, you just think mozzarella. But melted, burnt cheddar cheese is delicious. Nothing like mozzarella. It has a different flavor profile entirely. Totally different, and the way they do it is super cool. I mean, butter fat is going into the dough, and it's flavoring the dough, and it's texturizing the dough. And then we're putting hot sauce when it comes out. We call it Detroit pizza with a New York accent. There you go. So we don't want to give you all our secrets, but what we do is the doughs are rolled by hand. They're put in proof in boxes. And then they bring it up to us and we top it off and cook it right in the oven. So the cheddar, we're actually sourcing it from Wisconsin. We're working with a packer directly and he made us our own blend. Not super sharp, but we just wanted a good quality cheddar. They get put into the oven, 500 degrees. We cook the pizza for about 10 minutes in that oven. It has a stone hearth, so you get bottom heat and it cooks it from the bottom to the top. We're set up here to do volume. Those ovens do a lot of volume. You got that thin metal pan, which is super conducive to the heat, so you have that souffle effect. And then we're putting hot sauce when it comes out. A lot of garlic, a lot of parsley, a lot of crushed red pepper. Spicy, salty, delicious. Mama's and a recipe, huh? It's actually Mama's uh, cousin from Detroit's recipe. That's right. But anyway, it just it really works well because you don't cover the whole surface with the sauce. So you can see the cheese, you can see the sauce. We garnish it with a little bit of fresh parsley. I put a little sprinkle of pecorino at the end. I'm a New York guy, and I can't not do it. I put it on my cereal in the morning. Detroit does a lot of toppings. Plain is probably the most popular, but I would say pepperoni after that. We use the best pepperoni there is. And Paul, cut, baby. Paul Mel. Nothing Paul, but the best. Paul Mel makes us our own blend of pepperoni. We got our own pigs. The casing is very, you know, good for cup and curl. We do uh, sausage, onion, butter, parsley, a little bit of maple syrup when it comes out. Kind of tastes like a McDonald's breakfast. Delicious. Different. Do a nice mushroom pie. Mushroom. I put the big giant mushrooms, we put them on raw. A lot of parsley, a lot of garlic, white wine. It's all good. All right, so mustard pizza. Not really a Detroit thing, but a delicious thing. My buddy from Paris, he says in France, they all make pizza with Dijon mustard and Gruyere. So we do it with brown spicy mustard and cheddar. There's also a guy in uh, Trenton, New Jersey, he's famous for a mustard pie called Papa's Tomato Pies. It's delicious. The only difference is he puts tomato sauce. So, pizza's come a long way, guys, all right? I'm gonna do it with a little brisket and a little sauerkraut. Just the right amount to make it delicious, give you a little crunch, a little sour. I cover it with cheddar cheese. Now they're gonna go into the oven, about 12 minutes. You're gonna be eating mustard pizza. Hams, you got room in that oven? Detroit is a great city. I mean, you gotta remember something. Domino's is from Detroit, right? Jets is from Detroit. Little Caesars is from Detroit. You know, Detroit's a pizza city. I mean, come on, people forget that, right? I mean, Detroit has got a lot of great pizza. Hey, even though New Yorkers could be a little territorial about pizza, pizza's always constantly evolving here. And a lot of people, they're curious to know what a Detroit pie is, so we put a $5 pizza out there just to let the people try it. We call it slices by the pie. The guy comes in, goes, let me get a slice. Sure, we sell it by the whole square. It's five bucks, cut it in four corners. Sold out the door. I mean, it was a combination of loving the way that it tastes, loving the way that it looked, and loving the way that it came about. Come and get it while it's hot. Hurry up. <laughs> <laughs>